Hello, kindergarten friends. Happy Monday. We are going to jump into language arts. Our question this week is, what makes us want to visit a special place? So in our stories this week, we are going to look at some special places. We are looking at My View pages in our My View book and making sure we have a pencil ready. We are looking at pages 90 and 91 first, and then we'll do it letters on 92 and 93. We're going to look on the left side first. It says National Parks. National parks are special places. You might see interesting animals. So in the picture, you see a national park, and there are lots of different national parks around the United States, and um, there's even some here in Indiana. We can see a moose here and a buffalo. I see a boy with some binoculars looking out to see some animals. Over here on the right side of the page, we have our question again. What makes us want to visit a special place? You can hike. What might you see as you hike? So when you go for a hike, you go for like a long walk, and normally you need to make sure you bring water, maybe you had a backpack with some snacks. We'll have to make sure you wear some good shoes. You can't wear the flip-flops or the sandals when you go for a hike. You need some good shoes, like tennis shoes or running shoes, those kind of shoes. Um, and then uh, what could you see? You might be able to see some trees, animals. There is some old buildings here where um, Native Americans used to live. You can learn about the past. People lived here long ago. So you can see in the mountains and in the deserts, they had made houses. And then you can look at those pictures, and you can talk to somebody at home about what you see in there. Okay, we're going to turn to the next page. We are going to look at the letter P, and we're going to see which words or which picture words begin with P. And to make a P, I have my letter board here. And you're going to start all the way up at the sky. Draw a straight line up all the way down to the grass. Come back up to the sky and make a curve around right by the plane line. Okay? And a little piece, the same thing. But we're going to start at the plane line, go all the way down to the worm line, all the way down by the little worm. Start at the plane line again and curve it around. Okay? Let's look at it again. Start all the way at the top of the plane line. Go straight down. Pick up your pencil. Start at the plane or the sky line. Curve it around by the plane line. Little piece. Start at the plane line. Go all the way down to the worm line. Pick up your pencil, and you take your pencil from the plane line. Circle it around to the grass line. Okay. We look working on that letter P. I'm going to get my crayon, and we're going to look for the. Pup, pup, P sounds. Does pig begin with P? Thumbs up or thumbs down? Thumbs up. Go ahead and circle it. Does boat begin with P? The P, P, P. Thumbs up or thumbs down? Thumbs down. Boat begins with the B, B sound. How about tire? Does tire begin with the P, P sound? Thumbs up or thumbs down? Thumbs down. Cross it out. Does a push pin begin with P? Puh, puh, puh. Thumbs up, thumbs down, thumbs up. Push pin begins with P. How about cat? Does cat begin with a puh, puh sound? Thumbs up or thumbs down? Thumbs down. Cross out the kitty cat. It's a cute cat, but it doesn't begin with P. How about a pan? Does pan begin with P? Puh, pan? Yes, it does. Go ahead and circle it. How about Pear. Does pear begin with P? Thumbs up or thumbs down? P pear. Yes, it does. Go ahead and circle it. How about man? Does man begin with B? P? Thumbs up or thumbs down? Man. Thumbs down. Go ahead and cross out the man. Okay, on this side, we are going to look at the pictures, and we are going to write a P for any of the words that begin with P, P or any of the pictures that begin with P. So the first one is pig. Does pig begin with P? Thumbs up or thumbs down? Thumbs up. Write a big P and a little P. Okay, next is pencil. Does pencil begin with P? Thumbs up or thumbs down? Thumbs up. Go ahead and write P. Capital P and a lowercase P. Okay, how about ring? 
Does rain begin with P? Thumbs up or thumbs down? Thumbs down. Go ahead and cross out that rain. How about a piano? Does piano begin with T? Thumbs up or thumbs down? Thumbs up. Go ahead and write a P. A capital P and a lowercase P. Next, leaf. Does leaf begin with T? Thumbs up or thumbs down? Thumbs down. Go ahead and cross out the leaf. And the last one is pillow. Does pillow begin with P? Thumbs up or thumbs down? Thumbs up. Go ahead and write a P. Okay, boys and girls, remember, you can stop and pause the video at any time or go back if you need to. You don't need to do it as fast as Miss Beery. I will see you here tomorrow on Tuesday for some more language arts. Bye, friends.